What purpose does the gentleman from Texas rise? I ask unanimous consent to address the House for one minute. Without objection, gentlemen. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. It appears the administration is about to bomb Iraq. The stated reason is to force UN inspections of every inch of Iraqi territory to rule out the existence of any weapons of mass destruction. The president's personal problems may influence this decision, but a flawed foreign policy is behind this effort. Why is Iraq a greater threat to U.S. security than China, North Korea, Russia, or Iran? They all have weapons of mass destruction. Iraq, we bomb, and Red China, we send subsidies. This makes no sense. There was a time in our history that bombing foreign countries was considered an act of war done only with a declaration by this Congress. Today, tragically, it's done at the whim of presidents and the urging of congressional leaders without a vote, except maybe by the UN General Counsel. But the president is getting little support and a lot of resistance from our allies for this aggressive action. Sadly, our policy in the Middle East has served to strengthen the hand of Hussein, unify the Islamic fundamentalists, and expose American citizens to terrorist attacks. Hussein is now anxious for the bombs to hit to further stir the hatred and blame toward America for all the problems he has inflicted on his people.